exactly who they've replaced. We know that John de Wolf has gone off. Daly is off and Richards is off. It's a question of who has replaced who. This is for the Wolves. That is only as far as Goodman. Goodman making ground now. Running Booth. Booth staying with him. Goodman cutting inside. Turner speed to the byline. Low right beaten and it's out and over. To do right now, I do apologise for any of the Wolves fans who uh, see this video. We don't actually uh, get to see too many of their players down at Longmead, but uh, substitutes is uh, John DeWolf, as we expected, has come off at half time. So he only just got back from injury. I'll just break off for a second now. Ball coming over. Oh, fierce cross. Cowans, that's in. No. Oh. I thought that was going into that far corner. I'm not sure whether Lowart would have got to it, but the foot just got stuck out and deflected it away for a corner. I Let's hope he's agile enough to uh, keep the Wolves out. Corner over again. Back header. That's in. A uh, little back flick. And uh, unfortunately for the substitute keeper, his first touch is to pick it out of the net. Tutton picks it up, Mawson beaten in the air, Booth now with a bit of time, a bit of space, making ground, along the ground, looking for Emblem, inside, and Freeman just unable to get to it, it's headed out, Neil Emblem on the ball for the Wolves, being ch chased there by Overton, brought down, Mills, Overton in possession, good ball through to Mills, Mills on the wing for the Angels. Thompson then with the throw for Wolves to Goodman chips it inside leaves for Goodman lovely little nip ball through and there's the second goal scored by David Kelly number 8 for Wolves giving the goalkeeper no chance Goodman combining well there and it's two up then to the Wolves sit down Finally loses out. Cole Brand battling away there with Emblem. Robs him, does well to Emblem. Emblem wide now to Mawson. Mawson. Ball bouncing and bubbling. Handball. Referee says no, accident, play on. And it's Goodman on the ball in front of our position now. Tony Booth in front of him. A lovely through ball. Splits the defence there. Ball back inside for Kelly, and it's put away by Danny Tingley. Into touch, danger cleared. He's going to lose this. And it's Thomas bringing it away. Ball. It's put wide by Kelly to Goodman. Goodman now. Wide in front of him, straight forward to the Tunbridge goal. Chips the ball inside. Bull turns, turns again, tackles flying in, and it's just scrapes the bar, stays in play, and it's hacked away by Andy Mills. Some beautiful footwork from Steve Bull. He would expect them to be leading as they are at this stage. Into the penalty area, this is dangerous. Bull lays it off, a chip in, and Copley does beautifully. Pulls the ball down from a point blank header by John Goodman. Excellent. Free kick then to the Wolves. Deep one into the box, dangerous emblem up and his header wide, giving the goal kick to the Angels. Turns, turns again, beats his man well, puts a deep cross in. Goodman gets the head in and it's only just a little bit over the top. Dangerous moment there for Tunbridge. Duncan's just pointed out to me, of course, David Kelly is an Irish international. So what does that make it? Five, Duncan? Five, um, yeah. It's five full internationals and then under 21 on the pitch at the moment. Wide ball, beautiful ball. Tomat. <clears throat> yeah. 
And that's a goal kick. Dunk. ...and uh, anticipation and skills you expect from a side of their quality. And Tunbridge are finding it hard to break out of defence at the moment. But as I say that, Mawson's coming down the line. Cross comes up. Freeman's there. But it's just swung a little bit too far. Well, yes, David points out it's the same as happened against Charlton the last one, but I missed that one, so I couldn't comment on it. But uh, a little switch round there. Trying to give it a little bit... Uh, oof. Nice shot. Oh, uh, just just curled away at the last second. He's going for the top corner. Don Goodman's shot just curled away at the last second. Kelly. But, uh, Goodman. This is starting to show a bit in the pace, isn't it, um, Duncan? Holes are starting to open up. It's Goodman there in one of those holes, and it's in the side netting, and it's a corner. Yeah, as you say, David, it's uh, very hot out there. It's uh, obviously the, uh, the tiredness factor creeping in, a lot of work being put in by the players, fresh legs, and I rather suspect to give the uh, other players a run against a team of the quality of Wolves. Forward. Go on, Freeman. Go on, Mark. Battling away, yes. So Freeman did a little bit too much in the way of pushing. The ball's in the net. So Needless to say, it won't count, but he raised the cheer anyway. Thompson with the throw. Forward. Ball trying to get behind them all. Didn't quite come for him. Forster. Oh, there it is. That's that the one he wanted. That had to happen this afternoon, didn't it? Neil Emblem puts one in for the Wolves at the Longmead. I'm sure he really wanted that, and uh, we're all glad to see it. So that's three for the Wolves. And you'd expect Bull and Kelly to have got one. Emblem himself actually scored some few vital goals for Wolves in the league. Oh, he's through. Oh, and headed away under pressure there by uh, Tim Marshall. Box. Lofts it up. DeWolf emblem. Turns his man well. On a bit of a charge now. He's got a bull. Just keeps going. Keep his down well. <laughs> Great to see at least one go in, certainly. Freeman takes it on his back and uh, gets a bounce. Watkins takes it over. Marshall pulling off wide. He's got behind DeWolf. Oh, if that had just uh, rolled over the back of keeper Paul Jones, Marshall was there to slot it in. Bring it away. Freeman, Overton. Overton making ground down the middle. He puts it wide. Tim Marshall. And a brilliant save there. From Paul Jones, Tim Marshall kept his cool, he took his time, he tried to chip it over the top of the keeper, under the bar, very nearly made it, and Jones was equal to it, tipped it over the top. And Goodman, putting Steve Bull away, and that's way over the top. Is that going to be the last Wolves attack? It is indeed. That is the end of the game. Wolverhampton Wanderers have beaten Tunbridge Angels by three goals to nil here at Longmead. An excellent game. Good crowd. Lovely summer's day. Entertaining football. What more could you ask?